Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. So what I'd like to do is show you how to determine the unit vector um, when given a vector 3i minus 4j. So that is in a linear combination form. And I kind of erased because I worked on this problem for my video shut off, so I had to restart it. Um, but when I'm determining the unit vector, I like to write in component form. It's just something that I like. Um, I'm, I see a little bit better. So I'm going to rewrite this in component form. It's the exact same vector. One's as a linear combination. One is as, um, in, in our component form. And then to I look at the form for my unit vector is simply just taking my vector and divide it by its magnitude. So now I need to determine the magnitude. So I take the magnitude, and that's going to be the square root of v1 squared plus v2 squared. Well, the thing I like about this is that's v1 and that's v2. So now I take uh, 3 squared plus 4 squared. 3 squared equals 9, plus 4 squared equals 16, which equals the square root of 25, which equals 5. So now I simply just take my vector, the unit vector equals my vector 3, negative 4, divided by 5. I divide the 5 into both of those terms, and I get a final unit vector of 3 fifths, negative 4 fifths. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you determine your unit vector. Thanks.